Today is May 29, 2016, the second anniversary to the day of the South Berkshire Research Institute. What is your current project? Well, the current project that is being developed right now on the second anniversary is called the Fulcrum of Creation. And this has evolved from the very beginning, starting two years ago, uh, on the solutions for a 21st century global society. The first year we began the South Berkshire Research Institute into the principles of natural law, basically involving uh, the policies of non-aggression, um, sovereign rights for all humans, um, open source solutions in the social sciences, resource-based economics, and clean fuel-based energy solutions. Now this produced, after one year of research, uh, the power transition model and the Declaration of Sovereign Authority. Now this model described a dual existence or dual spheres of existence that depicted the physical world that we live in daily and the spiritual world that we ascend into from it. Now, this eventually came on into the second year of research under a narrower scope of um, the conversions of science and spirituality, number one, Number two revolved around the issues of disclosure. And number three around the ascension of human consciousness. So in the second year of research, we narrowed the scope considerably from the principles of natural law. Now this evolved into a series of experiments that occurred in August of last year through the end of September. Now, um, this series of, of experiments we are putting under the um, project name of Transcendence, Consciousness, and Transdimensional Phenomena. So the first year revealed the power transition model and the Declaration of Sovereign Authority, and the second year resulted in the current project Transcendence, Consciousness, and Transdimensional Phenomena. Where do you see it going from here? The research will eventually reveal more about the dualistic nature of our existence and the, the two spheres of existence, the one being the physical world and the other being the spiritual world. I think that the further research from here on out will narrow further on the development of the spiritual side of the equation and explore the divine principles. That's where I see it going from here. What do you hope to achieve um, kind of in the end with this whole project concerning beyond the Institute? Unity with the divine. 